deep philosophy, philosophy from our inner depth. Hello, Alice. Hello, Ron. You are a member of the Deep Philosophy Group, and you often participate in our sessions where we contemplate on philosophical texts. And you told me that a text that you really found interesting and touching was by Simone Weil. Simone Weil was a French philosopher of the 20th century, very spiritual, she emphasizes uh, very often she emphasizes suffering and beauty and goodness and uh, the spiritual. And here in this text that you chose, it's a chapter from her main book, Gravity and Grace. And this chapter is about attention and will, attention and will, which for Veil are two attitudes to life. One is the will is where I impose myself on reality. I want something. I try to manipulate the world. And the other one is attention, which is a more listening kind of attitude to life and to the world. Alice, can you tell us, can you explain what you found meaningful in this chapter? What touched you? I find many, very meaningful uh, the contemplative attitude of uh, attention. In fact, um, I tried during the week after uh, our DP session on this text to practice it. And uh, I've noticed that uh, especially when I am talking with other people, uh, I am really pre present in that moment and uh, in that particular occasion, I can really stay there with the people I have in front of. And, um, and I can perceive that our relationship can grow in that moment and that there is something else. And uh, I can also be there and really listening at what uh, uh, the other person is uh, telling to me. So, so attention, as you understand, uh, Vail and as Vail describes, is a kind of contemplative attitude to the world. You say where you are really listening, where things are present to you. You just don't just rush through the words or through the actions, but you actually you 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 make everything present and meaningful. And this, you say, is especially powerful in relations to others, to other people. Yeah. Yeah, because I am really there and the other person is not uh, an object, but uh, a real person with uh, his own or his her or, uh, or her story. And so this is yeah. really meaningful. So I wonder if we can try to understand more fully what this attitude, which you call contemplative and, and they called it uh, at, uh, uh, attention, what it involves it's both an active and passive uh, action because uh, i am there i am not just listening to the other people but uh, i am there fully present with my mind with my heart uh, and with my whole, whole person um, instead uh, i want not to, to act immediately to reply uh, to him immediately, but uh, I listening to him and then I uh, perceive what he really wants and what he really intends to, to say to me. Do you have a sentence or a couple of sentences from her text, from the text of Vail, that especially you found meaningful? Yes, of course. I, I want to read these sentences. It is only effort without desire which infallibly contains a reward. The authentic and pure values such as truth, beauty and goodness in the activity of a human being are the result of a certain application of a full attention to the object. Yeah. And, and can you explain a little bit what yes. this sentence says to you? Okay, yes, I think that it summarizes quite well what we have already said and uh, by, by meaning that uh, if uh, I am in a will attitude, 
I want to grasp the object or I want to catch uh, the other person. I want to tame him, I want to dominate. Uh, instead, uh, if uh, I can keep a contemplative mood, uh, I am really attached to the real values of life, to truth, beauty, love, friendship, and so on. And so I can really be there with the other person. And so I can also grow. Very interesting. Yeah. So Bail, in a way, shows not only, she doesn't only have a theory, she also shows how it is possible to live in everyday moments. Yes. Yes, she indicates us the way to, to, to reach these values. She shows us the way how to reach what is valuable in life. Yeah. Thank you, Alice. Thank you for Thank your Thank you answer. very much, Ran.